Find the Maclaurin series for f of x equals sine of x cubed solution. We'll start by writing down the Maclaurin series for sine x. So sine x is equal to the infinite sum as n runs from 0 to infinity. And in the numerator, we have a negative 1 to the n. And the sine function is odd, so the exponent here is odd. So 2n plus 1. And then you just divide by 2n plus 1 factorial. If it was cosine, instead of 2n plus 1, you would have 2n because cosine is an even function. So easy trick. Um, sine is odd, so you have 2n plus 1. Cosine is even, so you have 2n's instead of 2n plus 1's. Okay, we want to find the Maclaurin series for the sine of x cubed. So the sine of x cubed, this is equal to the infinite sum as n runs from 0 to infinity. We still have the negative 1 to the n. There's no x's there. But here we have an x, so we're going to replace that with x cubed. So this is x cubed to the 2n plus 1. And in the denominator, we still have 2n plus 1 factorial. Let's keep going. This is equal to the infinite sum as n runs from 0 to infinity. We still have the negative 1 to the n. Now we have to deal with, with this piece here. All you do is uh, use properties of exponents. So 3 times 2n is 6n, so we get x to the 6n. And then 3 times 1 is 3, so 6n plus 3. And all of this is being divided by 2n plus 1 factorial. And that's it. That's all you have to do. I hope this helps.